Hi, this is Chef Paul with today's Culinary Minute. In today's segment, I'm going to talk to you about sharpening knives. If you've got a set of basic knives like these, you want to find a way to keep them nice and sharp. First thing I'm going to advise you, please don't ever store them in a drawer. If you've got your mom's or your grandma's glass cutting board at home, please don't ever use your knives on it because it's the sure way to damage a knife. Now in the professional kitchen, I've got this nice big whetstone. It's an oil stone, has three different sides. And basically we take the knife, and this is on the fine stone, and we run it from in and then back over, running it back and forth at a, about a 20 to 25 degree angle to get a nice, smooth, even finish. The problem is, is that even though we've got that knife nice and sharp, some of those feathers may not be perfectly aligned. So what we're gonna use is a steel. Now, this may look like an old, old piece of metal, and it really is. But the real remarkable thing about it is, this is harder than my knife. So what I can do, and you've probably all seen this, a butcher do this, is take the knife and run it down the steel. And what he's doing is actually taking those feathers and straightening them up. Now, a steel will not sharpen a knife. But what it will do is, in between honings of a knife, the steel will re-straighten the blade. As I said before, the edge of the blade has these tiny feathers. As you work the blade onto a cutting surface, the feathers start to fold over. The steel straightens them back up. Now eventually, over a period of time, those feathers are going to fold all the way over and we're going to have to re-edge or re-hone the blade. We can do it a couple ways. At home, this is a great tool to have. It's a V-groove with two carbide blades. For a basic set of knives, it's a great tool to have. Hold the knife down flat and then run this down the knife. And what it's going to do is it's actually going to re-establish the edge of the blade. When we're done with that, we take a steel, a couple of swipes on the steel, and our knife is ready to use. Thanks a bunch. This is Chef Paul, and I'll see you next time.